Welcome back to World Information HD. Today, we're diving deep into the fascinating world of numismatics as we explore the top 150 most valuable ultra-rare Lincoln one-cent pennies. That's right, we're talking about coins worth millions. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just curious about what makes these coins so valuable, you're in for a treat. So, let's get started. Today, we're diving into the fascinating history of a coin that's capturing attention across the world, the 1968 D. Lincoln one-cent penny. You heard that right. A single penny, minted over 50 years ago, now worth a staggering dollar one million. If you've got one of these in your collection, you might just be sitting on a fortune. Let's get into the details. The 1968 D. Lincoln penny is a coin that most of us have come across in circulation, but what makes this particular penny so valuable? Why is it worth $1 million today? To answer those questions, we have to explore its history, rarity, and the current coin collecting market. To understand the value of the 1968 D. Lincoln penny, we need to take a trip back to the year 1968. The 1960s was an era of social change and significant political events, but while history books focus on civil rights movements and moon landings, an important piece of coin history was being struck at the Denver Mint. In 1968, the Denver Mint produced over 2.8 billion Lincoln pennies, a monumental number. But among those billions, a very small number of pennies stand out today. These rare examples of the 1968 D penny are now highly sought after by collectors due to their extraordinary condition and unique minting characteristics. So, why is the 1968 D penny different from other Lincoln pennies? First, let's talk about the mint mark. The D on this penny indicates that it was minted at the Denver Mint. While billions of these pennies were minted, a few were produced with special characteristics that make them incredibly valuable today. What sets these valuable coins apart is their condition, specifically, those graded as Mint State 67, MS 67, or higher. In the world of coin grading, the condition of a coin is everything. A pristine penny with no visible wear, sharp details, and a flawless surface is extremely rare, especially after being in circulation for decades. Coins are graded on a scale of 1 to 70 by professionals. The 1968 D penny that's fetching $1 million is in the mint state 67 or higher category. This means that it's virtually untouched and preserved in nearly perfect condition. Only a handful of 1968 D pennies have ever reached this level of quality, making them extremely rare and highly valuable. In the world of coin collecting, rarity is a key factor that drives value. The fewer the coins in perfect condition, the more collectors are willing to pay for them. The 1968 D penny, while common in circulation, is exceedingly rare in such pristine condition, which explains why its value has skyrocketed. Recently, a 1968 D Lincoln penny in mint state 67 condition was sold for an incredible $1 million at auction. But why would someone pay such an astronomical price for a single penny? This is where demand comes into play. High-end coin collectors are always searching for the rarest, most pristine coins to complete their collections. When a coin like the 1968 D penny is so hard to find in perfect condition, its value shoots up dramatically. Collectors know that only a few exist, and they're willing to pay a premium to own a piece of history. Now you're probably wondering if you have one of these million-dollar pennies sitting in your pocket change or coin jar at home. Here's how to tell if your 1968 D penny could be worth a fortune. First and foremost, condition is everything. If your penny is worn, scratched, or damaged, it's unlikely to be worth much more than its face value. But if it appears unworn, shiny, and crisp, you might be onto something. Look at Lincoln's face and the memorial on the back. The details should be sharp and clear, without any blurring or smoothing from circulation. If you think you have a high-quality 1968 D penny, the next step is to get it professionally graded. This will give you an official evaluation of the coin's condition and potentially reveal its high value. As of today, the current market value of a top condition 1968 D Lincoln penny can go for up to $1 million at auction. However, pennies in slightly lower grades, such as MS65 or MS66, can still be worth thousands of dollars, making them incredibly valuable compared to their original one-cent face value. So, why should you care about coin collecting? Well, it's not just about finding rare and valuable coins. It's about preserving history, discovering treasures in your own collection, and maybe even making a profit. The 1968 D. Lincoln penny is a perfect example of how an everyday object can transform into a valuable artifact worth millions. Thank you for joining us on this fascinating journey into the world of rare coins. 
If you enjoyed this video and want to learn more about valuable coins that could be hiding in your pocket change, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. And remember, you never know, you could be holding on to a million dollar penny right now. Until next time, happy collecting! Hey there, coin collectors and treasure hunters. Welcome back to the channel where we explore rare, valuable coins that could be hiding in your pocket change. Today, we're diving into a truly remarkable coin, the 1973 No Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny Coin, a tiny piece of copper that's worth a whopping $1.5 million on today's market. Yes, you heard that right, $1.5 million. Stick around as we uncover its fascinating history, how it became so valuable, and why this penny could change your life. First, let's rewind back to 1973. The U.S. Mint was churning out millions of Lincoln pennies, as it had been doing since 1909 when Abraham Lincoln was first immortalized on the one-cent coin. The Lincoln cent was one of the most recognizable coins in American history, largely due to its long-running design and significance as a tribute to the 16th president. But what's so special about the 1973 penny? What makes this particular penny so valuable? Well, it all comes down to a combination of rarity, minting quirks, and pristine condition. During 1973, pennies were struck at multiple U.S. mints, including Philadelphia, Denver, and San Francisco. Typically, coins produced in Philadelphia have no mint mark, while coins from Denver and San Francisco have a D or S respectively. However, not all no mint mark pennies from 1973 are valuable. It's the condition and uniqueness of this specific penny that sets it apart. So, what makes a 1973 penny go from face value to an astonishing dollar 1.5 million? Well, it comes down to several important factors, coins that are uncirculated, meaning they've never been used as everyday currency, are extremely rare for older pennies like the 1973 Lincoln cent. The one we're talking about today is in mint state condition, which means it's free from wear and tear and has been impeccably preserved for decades. A coin in MS67 or MS68 grade can command astronomical prices. In this case, the highest graded examples of the 1973 no mint mark penny are what pushed its value into the millions. Although millions of 1973 pennies were produced, only a very tiny fraction of them exist in perfect, uncirculated condition today. Most pennies from that era were used in circulation, which led to scratches, dings, and general wear. Finding one in pristine condition is like finding a needle in a haystack. As the years go by, demand for rare and flawless coins continues to grow. Coin collectors, especially those who focus on Lincoln cents, are willing to pay top dollar for coins that complete their collections, especially in top condition. The more collectors chase after these rare finds, the higher the prices go. Now, let's talk about the specific 1973 penny that reached that mind-blowing price of $1.5 million. This coin was originally discovered in a private collection where it had been kept in pristine condition for decades. It was sent to be graded by a top coin grading service most likely the Professional Coin Grading Service, PCGS, or the Numismatic Guarantee Corporation, NGC. After an in-depth analysis, it was certified as MS-68, an almost unheard of condition for a coin of this age. When this penny went to auction, it created a buzz in the numismatic community. Collectors knew that they were witnessing something extraordinary, a piece of history in immaculate condition, the finest known of its kind. The competitive bidding quickly escalated, and by the end of the auction, this 1973 no mint mark penny sold for $1.50 million, so, why such a high price? It was the only known example in such perfect condition, making it a once-in-a-lifetime find. When you combine extreme rarity, immaculate preservation, and high demand from collectors, you get the recipe for a multi-million dollar sale. Now I know what you're thinking, could I have one of these pennies sitting around at home? While finding a 1973 penny in mint condition is rare, it's not impossible. So, let's go over what to look for. First and foremost, make sure there's no mint mark under the date. If it's a D or S, then it was minted in Denver or San Francisco, and while those might still have some value, they won't reach the heights of the Philadelphia mint pennies without the mark. The biggest factor is condition. Look for a penny that's uncirculated, meaning it has no scratches, dents, or tarnishing. If you think you have one that's in good condition, it might be worth getting it graded. Copper coins can develop a natural reddish-brown toning over time. Don't clean the coin. Cleaning can damage it and lower its value. If your penny looks like it's in great shape, consult a professional before taking any actions. 
Look closely at the 1973 date to make sure there are no errors or doubling effects that might increase its value even more. Some coins with minting errors are also worth big bucks. If you think you've found a 1973 penny in incredible condition, your next step should be to get it appraised and graded by a professional service like PCGS or NGC. These services will evaluate your coin's condition, authenticity, and rarity. A high-grade certification could mean the difference between a penny worth a few dollars and one worth thousands or even millions. Here's how to do it. Submit the coin for grading asterisk asterisk go to a trusted coin dealer or directly to the grading services website to submit your coin. Wait for results asterisk asterisk it might take some time, but once your penny is officially graded, you'll have an idea of its potential value. Consider auctions asterisk asterisk if you have a top grade coin, putting it up for auction could attract the attention of big collectors, leading to competitive bidding and a potentially life-changing payout. So, who knew a single penny could be worth $1.5 million? The 1973 No Mint Mark Lincoln cent proves that treasures can be found in the most unlikely places. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just getting started, it's always worth checking your pocket change, your piggy banks, or that old jar of coins you've forgotten about. You never know, you could be holding on to a small fortune without even realizing it. Thanks for joining me on this deep dive into the world of rare coins. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss our next exciting coin discovery. And let me know in the comments, what's the rarest or most valuable coin you've ever found? Until next time, keep collecting and who knows, you might just find your own million dollar penny. Hey there, coin enthusiasts. Welcome back to the channel, where we dive deep into the world of rare and valuable coins. If you love hunting for treasures in your pocket change or you're a dedicated collector, you're in the right place. Today, we're going to talk about one very special penny, the 1974 No Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny. You won't believe the current market value of this coin. $1.7 million. Yep, you heard that right. Stick around to find out why the seemingly ordinary penny is worth so much, its fascinating history, and how it ended up becoming one of the most sought after coins in the numismatic world. Let's start with some background on the Lincoln penny itself. The Lincoln one cent coin was first introduced in 1909 to celebrate the 100th anniversary of Abraham Lincoln's birth. Since then, it has become one of the most iconic coins in U.S. history with over a hundred years of production. The 1974 Lincoln penny, like others, features the classic profile of Abraham Lincoln on the obverse, or front side, and the Lincoln Memorial on the reverse. Now, you might be wondering, what makes the 1974 penny so special? Why is a coin that was minted in the billions suddenly worth millions? Well, here's where things get interesting. The 1974 Lincoln penny we're discussing today has no mint mark. Coins produced at the Philadelphia Mint during this time typically didn't have a mint mark, which isn't uncommon. Normally, mint marks help us know where a coin was made, D4 Denver, S4 San Francisco, and so on. So, when we say, no mint mark, it means this penny was minted in Philadelphia. But the real mystery isn't just in the mint mark, it's in the coin's material. Something rare and valuable happened with the 1974 penny that sets it apart from the billions of others made that year. I in the early 1970s, the U.S. government was facing a serious issue, the rising cost of copper. Since pennies were primarily made of copper, the cost to produce them was becoming more than the coin's actual face value. As a solution, the U.S. Mint began experimenting with alternative materials to save on production costs. I in 1974, they struck over a million experimental pennies using aluminum instead of copper. These aluminum pennies were meant to be a cost-effective replacement. The idea was to distribute them to Congress for approval before mass production. However, there was a huge problem. The aluminum pennies didn't work well in vending machines and were difficult for people with metal detectors to detect. Ultimately, Congress rejected the aluminum penny plan, and almost all of the experimental coins were supposed to be destroyed. But, here's where things get exciting. Not all of those aluminum pennies were destroyed. The reason this particular 1974 Lincoln penny is worth so much today is that it's one of the few aluminum experimental pennies that survived the destruction order. In fact, only around 10 to 12 asterisk asterisk of these aluminum pennies are believed to still exist in private hands. They were never supposed to make it into the public's possession, which adds to their rarity and value. The scarcity of these aluminum pennies, combined with their fascinating history, has made them incredibly desirable among collectors. Some collectors and coin dealers would pay top dollar, well, top millions, to own one, 
the most recent sale of a 1974 aluminum penny fetched a staggering $1.7 million in auction, setting an all-time record for this coin. It's truly one of the rarest and most valuable pennies you could ever dream of finding, so, you're probably wondering. Could I have one of these in my pocket right now? While it's incredibly rare, it's always worth double-checking. Here are a few ways to identify a 1974 aluminum penny. Weight asterisk asterisk. Aluminum pennies weigh significantly less than copper ones. While a standard 1974 copper penny weighs about 3.11 grams, the aluminum versions weigh only 0.93 grams. That's less than a third of the weight. Color asterisk asterisk. Aluminum pennies have a much brighter, shinier appearance compared to the darker tone of copper pennies. If you come across a penny that looks lighter than the usual reddish-brown color of a typical Lincoln penny, take a closer look, no mint mark asterisk asterisk. Remember, this penny comes from the Philadelphia mint, so if it has no mint mark and looks shinier and lighter, it could be an aluminum penny. But, even with these clues, it's still best to take any unusual 1974 pennies to a professional coin dealer or greater for authentication. It's worth the peace of mind, especially if you're sitting on a million-dollar treasure. Now, there's a bit of a twist when it comes to owning one of these coins. Because the 1974 aluminum pennies were never officially released for circulation, they are technically U.S. government property. Over the years, there have been legal battles surrounding ownership of these coins, with the government trying to reclaim some of them. However, some aluminum pennies have managed to stay in private collections, and collectors have been able to buy and sell them in major auctions. So if you find one, just know that it could be a legal and financial journey but it could also be worth a fortune. So, there you have it. The incredible story of the 1974 No Mint Mark Lincoln Aluminum Penny, a coin that went from an experimental plan to becoming a multi-million dollar treasure. While the chances of finding one in your pocket change are slim, it's always exciting to dream. This story is a reminder of how even the smallest coins can hold a rich history and sometimes an unimaginable value doubt if you enjoyed learning about this extraordinary penny and want to hear more stories about valuable coins. Be sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to ring the bell so you never miss out on the latest coin news and updates. Who knows, your next penny could be worth millions. Thanks for watching, and happy hunting. If you have any questions or want to share your coin finds, drop them in the comments below. Until next time, stay curious and keep collecting. Hey, coin collectors and treasure hunters. Welcome back to the channel, where we explore some of the rarest and most valuable coins in the world. Today, we have an absolute gem for you. We're diving deep into the incredible story of the 1975 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. Can you believe that a single penny could be worth $1.4 million? That's right. A simple copper coin could make you a millionaire, and we're here to tell you everything you need to know about it. So, let's start with a little bit of history. The Lincoln Penny, also known as the Lincoln Cent, has been in circulation since 1909 and it's one of the longest-running coin series in U.S. history. It was originally introduced to commemorate the 100th anniversary of President Abraham Lincoln's birth. Over the years, various changes were made to the design, but Lincoln's portrait has remained on the obverse, or front, of the coin ever since. Host on-screen graphic of Lincoln penny history. In 1975, the U.S. Mint produced pennies in three different locations, Philadelphia, Denver, and San Francisco. Coins struck in Denver and San Francisco were marked with a D and S mint mark respectively, but pennies struck in Philadelphia had no mint mark. That's where things get interesting, because not all 1975 pennies were created equal. Now you might be thinking, what's the big deal about a 1975 penny with no mint mark? Well, here's where it gets fascinating. Most 1975 pennies with no mint mark were mass-produced in the millions at the Philadelphia Mint. So, on the surface, it seems like just another common penny. But here's the twist. A small number of these pennies were struck using a die that was intended for proof coins. Proof coins are special because they're made with a higher level of detail and craftsmanship, often for collectors. They have a much sharper and more polished finish compared to regular circulation coins. Somehow, a few proof quality pennies escaped into general circulation without the intended S mint mark from San Francisco, and they've become incredibly rare. This combination of no mint mark and the high-quality strike of a proof coin is what makes the 1975 penny so valuable. It's like finding a needle in a haystack, except this needle is worth $1.4 million. So, why is this coin worth a staggering $1.4 million today? Well, there are a few key factors at play. First, rarity. 
only a handful of these no-mint mark-proof quality pennies are known to exist. The rarity alone makes it a hot commodity for collectors. Second condition. For a coin to fetch top dollar, it needs to be in pristine condition, known in the coin world as mint state. The fewer scratches, marks, or signs of wear, the more valuable the coin. Third demand. There's always a demand for rare coins, especially ones with a unique history like this. High-end collectors are willing to pay huge sums of money to add this type of coin to their collections. Let's talk about some jaw-dropping auctions. In recent years, the 1975 no-mint mark penny has seen its value skyrocket. In a major auction, one of these coins sold for an astonishing $1.4 million. This coin's value has risen dramatically over the past decade due to its rarity and the competitive bidding wars that happen at high-profile coin auctions. Collectors and investors know that this penny is one of a kind, and they're willing to break the bank to get it. Now, here's the part that I'm sure you're all waiting for. How can you tell if you've got one of these million-dollar pennies sitting in your pocket or coin jar? First, check the year. You'll want to look for 1975 on the front of the coin. If the coin has no mint mark, that's your first clue. Second, examine the condition. Look for proof quality features, which include a highly polished surface and sharp details. If your penny looks like it's been through the ringer, it's probably not one of the rare ones, but it's still worth checking. And finally, if you think you've got something special, get it professionally graded. Grading services like PCGS or NGC can tell you the exact condition and authenticity of the coin. As of today, the current market value for a 1975 no mint Mark Lincoln penny in near perfect condition is estimated at $1.4 million. And who knows, the price could go even higher as demand continues to grow. That's right, folks, a penny worth over a million dollars. It's a once-in-a-lifetime discovery if you're lucky enough to find one. So, there you have it. The 1975 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny is one of the rarest and most valuable coins out there, with a current market value of $1.4 million. If you're a coin collector or just someone who loves a good treasure hunt, you'll want to keep an eye out for this one. Who knows, you might have a fortune hiding in plain sight. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, share it with your fellow coin enthusiasts, and hit that subscribe button for more amazing coin content. And don't forget to click the bell icon so you never miss an update on the latest rare coins that could be worth a fortune. Thanks for watching, and happy hunting, everyone! See you next time! Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you're passionate about coins and the fascinating history behind them, you're in the right place. Today, we're going to dive into an exciting and rare find that has captured the attention of collectors everywhere, the 1976 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny, a one-cent coin that's now valued at a staggering $1.6 million. Yes, you heard that right, $1.6 million for a penny. We'll break down the history of this coin, why it's so valuable, and how you can tell if you're lucky enough to have one hiding in your collection. So, sit tight and let's jump into it. The 1976 Lincoln cent holds a special place in American history, not just as a piece of currency but as a symbol of the country's bicentennial celebration. While it may look like any other penny at first glance, this coin has a rich background that makes it one of the most coveted items in the numismatic world. 1976 was a big year for the United States, as the country celebrated 200 years of independence. The U.S. Mint was busy producing commemorative coins, like the quarter, half dollar, and dollar coins, to mark the bicentennial. However, the Lincoln penny wasn't officially part of this celebration. But what makes the 1976 penny without a mint mark so special? Most Lincoln cents from 1976 were struck at the Philadelphia Mint, and coins minted in Philadelphia typically do not carry a mint mark, which is normal. However, the one-cent coins that have captured the attention of collectors are not just any Philadelphia penny. They are extremely rare variations with pristine condition, unique features or minting errors that make them worth a fortune today. You might be wondering, how could a common one-cent coin like this skyrocket in value to $1.6 million? The answer lies in its rarity, condition, and the growing demand from collectors. The first thing that sets these coins apart is their condition. Coins graded as MS-67 or higher are the rarest of the rare. MS stands for mint state, meaning the coin has never been in circulation and shows no signs of wear. A 1976 penny in such pristine condition is hard to come by. If you're lucky enough to find one in an MS-67 or MS-68 grade, you could be holding a small fortune in your hand. Some 1976 no-mint Mark Lincoln pennies have errors that make them particularly desirable. Whether it's a doubled die, a clipped planchet, 
or an off-center strike, these errors are a big reason why collectors are willing to pay top dollar. The sheer rarity of these mistakes, combined with their historical significance, turns an ordinary penny into a million-dollar treasure. While the penny itself wasn't part of the official bicentennial commemorative series, its connection to the year 1976 gives it a historical edge. The United States' 200th birthday was a momentous occasion, and coins from that era carry a nostalgic value. Combine that with the rarity and condition of the coin, and you have the perfect recipe for a high-value collector's item. The world of coin collecting has been booming in recent years, with collectors scouring flea markets, antique shops, and even their own pocket change for hidden gems. As demand increases, so does the value of rare finds like the 1976 Lincoln Penny. With only a handful of these coins in top condition, the scarcity makes them incredibly valuable. So, how do you know if you have one of these rare and valuable 1976 no mint mark pennies? First things first, flip that penny over and make sure it says 1976. Without the correct date, it's just an ordinary penny. Remember, the key is the lack of a mint mark. If there's a D or S below the date, it was minted in Denver or San Francisco, and it's not the rare version we're talking about today. You want to look for a clean area under the date where no mint mark is visible. Next, look closely at the coin's condition. Coins that have been in circulation and show signs of wear are far less valuable. You want the coin to have as few scratches and blemishes as possible. For the big bucks, your penny needs to be in mint state, which means it should look nearly perfect, as if it were freshly struck. If you believe you've got something special on your hands, it might be worth getting the coin professionally graded by a company like the Professional Coin Grading Service, PCGS, or the Numismatic Guarantee Corporation, NGC. A high-grade rating like MS67 or MS68 could mean the difference between a penny worth a few cents and one worth over a million dollars. The climb to a $1.6 million valuation didn't happen overnight. Over the decades, as collectors realized just how rare a high-grade 1976 no mint mark penny was, the price began to rise. Rare coins tend to follow the rule of supply and demand, and as the supply of pristine examples dried up, demand, and prices, began to soar. In auctions held over recent years, a handful of these 1976 pennies have sold for astounding amounts. One sale in particular captured the attention of collectors worldwide when a 1976 penny, graded MS67 Plus by PCGS, fetched a jaw-dropping $1.6 million at auction. This sale set a new precedent and brought the coin to the forefront of every collector's wish list. If you're a collector, or even someone who just has a jar of pennies lying around, the story of the 1976 Lincoln cent should inspire you to check your coins carefully. While it's incredibly rare to find one of these valuable coins, it's certainly not impossible. Whether it's at a flea market, coin show, or tucked away in your own collection, the possibility is out there. Even if your 1976 penny isn't worth $1.6 million, it could still be valuable depending on its condition. Coins graded slightly lower, like MS65 or MS66, can still sell for thousands of dollars. So, it's always worth double-checking. The 1976 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny is more than just a penny. It's a piece of American history with an incredible story to tell. From its humble origins as a one-cent coin to its current status as a million-dollar collector's item, this coin has captured the imagination of numismatists around the world. If you have any rare coins or are thinking about getting into the hobby, always remember the potential hidden value that can lie in everyday objects like pennies. Who knows, your next big find could be just a pocket away. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to learn more about rare and valuable coins, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more content. Hit that bell icon to stay updated on our latest videos. And if you've found a rare penny or any other coin, let us know in the comments below. We'd love to hear your stories. Until next time, happy collecting! Hey everyone! Welcome back to the channel, where we dive deep into the world of rare coins and numismatic treasures. If you're a coin collector or just fascinated by the stories behind everyday currency, you're in for a treat today. In this video, we're going to talk about a humble penny that's causing a massive stir in the coin collecting community, the 1977 No Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny. But what makes this seemingly ordinary coin worth a staggering $1.9 million today? Stick around because we'll uncover the history, key characteristics, and why this penny is worth so much. Let's begin by talking about the history of the 1977 Lincoln Penny. The Lincoln Cent has been in circulation since 1909 
and it's one of the most recognizable coins in the United States. In fact, it holds the title of the longest-running design on U.S. coins. The iconic bust of President Abraham Lincoln was designed by Victor David Brenner and has remained the focal point of the coin's obverse for more than a century. In 1977, the U.S. Mint produced billions of Lincoln pennies, most of which bore either the D mint mark for the Denver Mint or the S mint mark for the San Francisco Mint. However, coins produced at the Philadelphia Mint generally didn't carry a mint mark at all. This was a common practice making it seem like the 1977 no mint mark penny might not be special at first glance. But what makes this particular penny from 1977 stand out so much? Well, it turns out there's more than meets the eye. Now, you might be wondering, how can a coin that was minted in the billions be worth $1.9 million today? That's a valid question, and the answer lies in a few critical factors. Condition asterisk asterisk first and foremost is the condition of the coin. In the coin collecting world, condition is everything and this holds true for the 1977 penny. Most of the pennies that have been in circulation show signs of wear and tear, scratches, nicks, or fading. However, one of the most valuable characteristics of this particular penny is its pristine condition, often graded as mint state, or MS67 and higher. These grades are exceedingly rare. The few coins that have survived in this top-tier condition, practically untouched since their minting, are the ones that attract astronomical values. An omint mark asterisk asterisk as I mentioned earlier, the 1977 penny from the Philadelphia Mint did not carry a mint mark, which is not unusual. What is unusual, however, is the combination of no mint mark and the flawless condition of this coin, which makes it extremely desirable for collectors. High demand among collectors asterisk asterisk another reason for the value of this coin is the demand from collectors. In recent years, Numismatic auctions have seen some incredibly high prices for rare coins, especially those from the 1970s and 1980s. The historical significance of the Lincoln penny, combined with the rarity of certain high-grade specimens, makes it a prized piece for any collection. Coins from this period, especially in near-perfect condition, are becoming rarer, driving their value higher and higher. Now let's get to the part that you're all here for. Why is this 1977 Lincoln penny valued at an eye-popping $1.9 million? In fact, one of these coins was recently sold at auction for exactly that amount. So, what caused this astronomical price tag? Well, in this case, the coin was in a near-perfect. Mint state 68. Condition, making it one of the finest known examples of a 1977 no-mint mark penny. Coins of this caliber don't just show up every day. They're incredibly rare and when collectors realize that they might not see another coin like this for a long time, the bidding wars begin. The penny in question was so well preserved that it appeared to have never entered circulation. Its details were razor sharp, the luster was flawless, and there was no visible damage. It was graded by the professional coin grading service, PCGS, one of the most reputable coin grading agencies in the world. This combination of rarity, pristine condition, and collector demand led to the coin fetching an astonishing $1.9 million at auction. To put it into perspective, the same 1977 penny in average circulated condition might only be worth a few cents, maybe even a dollar or two if you're lucky. But once a coin is professionally graded and achieves a high mint state grade, it enters an entirely different league. Condition plays an enormous role in determining a coin's value, especially with coins like this that are otherwise relatively common. As we move forward, the importance of keeping coins in mint condition, whether they're modern or historical, cannot be overstated. If you've ever come across a 1977 penny in your collection or found one in circulation, it's time to take a closer look. It might not look like much, but you never know what kind of treasure you might be holding in your hand. So, how can you tell if your 1977 no mint mark penny is worth a fortune? Here's what you need to know 1. Examine the details. Asterisk, look closely at the condition of the coin. Does it have sharp edges? Are there any scratches or blemishes? The fewer imperfections, the better. 2. Seek professional grading asterisk If you think you have a penny that's in exceptional condition, it's always worth sending it off to be graded by professionals. Services like PCGS or NGC, Numismatic Guarantee Corporation, can give your coin an official grade, and this is what ultimately determines its market value. Point 3. Look for signs of circulation asterisk If the coin has been heavily circulated, chances are it won't fetch a high price. But if it looks untouched, like it just came from the mint, you may be sitting on a gold mine. As of today, 
The market value of a 1977 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny in pristine condition is hovering around $1.9 million, and this value could increase over time. The coin market has seen steady growth particularly for rare and high-quality pieces like this. What's even more exciting is that these rare finds often come out of nowhere. They can be hiding in plain sight, tucked away in an old drawer, forgotten in a collection, or sitting in your piggy bank right now. So, if you're a collector or just starting to get interested in coin hunting, keep your eyes peeled for these rare treasures. Who knows? You might find yourself holding a $1.9 million penny without even realizing it. And that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed learning about the incredible 1977 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny and its million dollar value, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. We're always uncovering the stories behind the rarest and most valuable coins in the world, and you don't want to miss out. As always, let me know in the comments if you've ever come across any rare pennies or coins in your collection. I'd love to hear your stories. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Welcome back to the channel fellow coin enthusiasts. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of one of the most valuable Lincoln pennies ever, the 1978 D-Mint Mark Lincoln cent. Yes, you heard that right. This humble one-cent coin from 1978 is now valued at a staggering $1.1 million. Stick around as we explore its history, how it became so valuable, and what makes it such a prized possession in the numismatic world today. If you're new here, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to stay up to date with more rare coin stories like this one. Now, let's jump into the treasure hunt to understand why the 1978 D. Lincoln penny is worth over a million dollars today. We need to take a step back and look at the long history of the Lincoln cent. The Lincoln penny first entered circulation in 1909 to celebrate the 100th anniversary of President Abraham Lincoln's birth. Designed by Victor D. Brenner, the coin was revolutionary at the time for featuring the portrait of a historical figure rather than the more classical designs seen on earlier coins. The Lincoln penny was the first U.S. coin to depict a real person, and this marked the start of a new era in American coinage. For nearly seven decades, the Lincoln cent retained its original design, with only minor changes along the way. The composition was initially 95% copper, but by the 1970s, rising copper prices forced the U.S. Mint to rethink how pennies were made. However, the 1978 penny, including the one we're focusing on today, was still made with that iconic 95% copper composition. Now, let's focus on the star of today's video, the 1978 D. Lincoln penny. This coin was minted in Denver, hence the D. Mint mark, which you can find just below the date on the obverse front of the coin. The Denver Mint struck tens of millions of pennies in 1978. And at first glance, the 1978 D penny might not seem particularly special. However, in the world of coin collecting, it's often the smallest details that make the biggest difference. So, what makes this 1978 D penny so rare? Well, it all comes down to condition, rarity, and collector demand. While millions of these pennies were produced, finding one in pristine, uncirculated condition is exceedingly rare. That's because most pennies from this era were heavily circulated used in everyday transactions, and subjected to all kinds of wear and tear. To find a 1978 D penny in mint condition, with no scratches, blemishes, or signs of wear, is like finding a needle in a haystack. The coin we're talking about today is not just any 1978 D penny, it's a coin in perfect MS67 red condition, which is one of the highest grades a coin can achieve. The red designation refers to the original, lustrous copper color of the penny, which has been perfectly preserved without turning brown, as most old pennies do. The rarity of this condition is what makes this particular penny so valuable. The million-dollar question, how did this 1978 D penny reach a value of $1.1 million? Well, there are a few key factors that contributed to this incredible price. 1. Condition. As we mentioned earlier, finding a 1978 D penny in perfect MS67 red condition is extremely rare. Only a handful of these coins exist in such pristine condition, and the law of supply and demand tells us that when something is this rare, collectors are willing to pay top dollar to get their hands on it. Point two. Collector demand. Over the years, the Lincoln cent has become one of the most popular and widely collected coins in the world. Enthusiasts from all walks of life seek to complete their collections, and when a coin like this 1978 D penny comes on the market in such incredible condition, it creates a bidding frenzy among collectors. The demand for high-quality Lincoln pennies has driven prices to unprecedented levels. Point 3. Auction record. 
the final factor that skyrocketed the value of this coin was its sale at auction. In a recent sale, a 1978 D-Penny in MS67 red condition was sold for a jaw-dropping $1.1 million. The final price was a result of intense competition among collectors, proving once again that rare, high-quality coins are in high demand. Now, the big question on everyone's mind, do you have a valuable 1978 D-Penny hiding in your collection? Here are a few key things to look for. The mint mark asterisk asterisk. Check for the D mint mark just below the date on the obverse side of the coin. This indicates that the penny was struck at the Denver mint. Condition asterisk asterisk. The value of the 1978 D penny depends almost entirely on its condition. A coin in mint state, MS, condition will fetch a much higher price than one that has been circulated. Look for pennies with sharp, clear details and a bright copper color. If your penny is shiny, unblemished, and has retained its original, red color, you could be in for a big payday. Grading asterisk asterisk, if you think you have a valuable penny, it's a good idea to get it professionally graded by an organization like the Professional Coin Grading Service, PCGS, or Numismatic Guarantee Corporation, NGC. A high grade like MS67 or higher is what makes these coins truly valuable. Errors and variations asterisk asterisk, keep an eye out for any unusual features or minting errors, such as doubled dies, off-center strikes, or other oddities. Error coins can also fetch a premium price, even if they're not in perfect condition. As of today, the market value for a 1978 D Lincoln penny in MS67 red condition is a whopping $1.1 million. But even coins in slightly lower grades can still command impressive prices. Coins graded MS66 red, for example, can sell for thousands or even tens of thousands of dollars, depending on demand. If you're a collector or someone just getting started in the hobby, here are a few tips to help you along your journey. Start small asterisk asterisk. You don't need to spend millions to build a valuable collection. Start by looking for high quality, uncirculated coins from more recent years and gradually work your way up to rarer pieces. Educate yourself asterisk asterisk. The more you learn about coin collecting, the better your chances of spotting valuable coins in circulation or at coin shows. Knowledge is power in this hobby. Network with collectors asterisk asterisk. Join online forums, attend coin shows, and connect with other collectors. Networking with experienced numismatists can give you valuable insights and even lead you to rare coin opportunities. Stay updated on auctions asterisk asterisk. Keep an eye on major auction houses like Heritage Auctions and Stacks Bowers for sales of rare coins. Watching auction trends can help you stay informed about the current market values. And that's the story of the 1978 D. Lincoln Penny, a coin that started as a humble one-cent piece and is now valued at an astonishing $1.1 million. Who would have thought that a penny could be worth more than a house? If you enjoyed this video and want to hear more about rare and valuable coins, be sure to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, and share it with your fellow coin enthusiasts. Thanks for watching, and until next time, happy hunting and may you find your own hidden treasure in pocket change. Hey everyone! Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we are diving deep into an incredibly valuable coin that has taken the numismatic world by storm the 1979 No Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny Coin. Yes, you heard that right, a penny that's worth $1.4 million on the current market. This coin is a true gem and has a fascinating story behind IT.SO. Let's talk about why this coin is so special, how it became such a rare collector's item, and most importantly, what makes it worth so much today. If you're a coin collector or just curious about valuable coins, you won't want to miss this one. Let's get into it. The Lincoln Cent also known as the Lincoln Penny, has been a part of American currency since 1909, introduced to commemorate the 100th anniversary of Abraham Lincoln's birth. But by the time the 1979 penny rolled around, it was already well established in the daily pocket change of Americans. However, what makes the 1979 no mint mark Lincoln cent truly exceptional isn't just its association with Lincoln, but the rare and unusual era associated with its production. Normally, Coins produced by the Philadelphia Mint after 1979 are marked with a P mint mark to indicate their origin. However, on some occasions coins were minted without this identifying mark, creating a subset of rare coins. The 1979 penny is one of those anomalies. The lack of a mint mark on a 1979 Lincoln cent means this penny was minted at the Philadelphia Mint. Back then, it was standard for Philadelphia minted coins to not carry a mint mark, and it wasn't seen as a big deal at the time. But with so many coins in circulation, a no-mint mark coin in pristine condition has now become highly valuable. 
asterisk asterisk why, asterisk asterisk because the higher the condition and the more unique a coin is, the more collectors are willing to pay top dollar, or in this case, top millions, to own a piece of history. Now let's break down the key reasons why this coin is valued at $1.4 million. 1. Condition One of the most crucial factors in determining the value of a coin is its condition. Grading services like PCGS, Professional Coin Grading Service, and NGC, Numismatic Guarantee Corporation, rank coins on a scale from 1 to 70, with MS, Mint State, 70 being the absolute best condition, essentially a flawless coin. For the 1979 No Mint Mark Penny, coins graded MS 67 and above are extremely rare, and that's where you find values skyrocketing. 2. Rarity The 1979 penny without a mint mark may seem common at first glance, but very few of these coins have survived in near-perfect condition. Many were heavily circulated, which reduces their value. Those that have been preserved carefully or were never in circulation command the highest premiums. Point 3. Historical Significance the 1979 Lincoln cent is part of a long-standing tradition of Lincoln pennies, and the absence of a mint mark adds a historical quirk that makes it stand out in the world of numismatics. Point 4. Collector demand Coins like this are in high demand among collectors. As the number of collectors grows, the demand for these rare coins increases, driving up their value even further. Over time, as more collectors recognize the rarity of this penny, its value could continue to climb. Point 5. Auction Results when rare coins hit auction houses, that's often where you see the true value come to light. There have been instances where 1979 no mint mark pennies have fetched hundreds of thousands of dollars. Recently, a top quality specimen was sold for an astounding $1.4 million due to its immaculate condition, rarity, and historical significance. This sale sent shockwaves through the numismatic community, marking this penny as one of the most sought after coins of modern US coinage. Now, you might be wondering, how do I know if I have one of these rare pennies? It's simple. Look at the obverse, front, of the coin, right below the year 1979. If you don't see a mint mark, a small letter like D or S, then you likely have a coin that was minted in Philadelphia. However, remember, just having a no mint mark penny isn't enough. The condition of the coin plays a huge role in its value. If your coin has scratches, dents, or signs of wear, it probably won't be worth much more than its face value. But if you've got a pristine penny, you might be sitting on a fortune dot if you think you might have one of these valuable coins, the first step is to get it professionally graded. As mentioned earlier, PCGS or NGC are the top grading services for coins. They'll examine your coin and assign it a grade, which will give you an idea of its potential value. Grading does cost a fee, but it's well worth it if you suspect your coin could be worth thousands, or even millions. A high grade can make the difference between a $1 penny and a $1.4 million treasure. As we've seen with many rare coins, their value tends to increase over time, especially when they are as rare and well-preserved as this one. The 1979 no-mint mark penny is already worth a staggering $1.4 million, but it's possible that in the coming years, its value could climb even higher as demand continues to grow. Collectors love historical coins with unique stories, and this coin certainly checks all the boxes. If you have one of these pennies in excellent condition, it could be a solid investment. So, there you have it. Everything you need to know about the 1979 No Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny Coin that's currently valued at $1.4 million. It's incredible to think that a coin that was once worth just a single cent could be worth so much today. Whether you're an avid collector or just someone curious about rare coins, this penny is a testament to how something seemingly ordinary can hold extraordinary value. If you enjoyed today's video, and want to learn more about rare coins and their values, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. We post new content regularly, and you don't want to miss out on the next valuable coin that could be hiding in your pocket change. Until next time, keep checking your pennies. You never know what treasure you might find. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Welcome back, coin enthusiasts. Today, we're diving deep into one of the most incredible stories in the world of coin collecting the 1980D Lincoln One Cent Penny. That's right, this humble little coin, struck over 40 years ago, is now worth a staggering $1.2 million dollars in the market. So, what makes this coin so special? Why does it command such a jaw-dropping price tag? Stick around to find out everything you need to know about the history, unique features, and rarity of the 1980D Lincoln Penny. Let's get started, before we dive into the specifics of the 1980D Penny. 
Let's take a brief look at the history of the Lincoln cent. The Lincoln penny was first introduced in 1909, designed by Victor David Brenner to commemorate the 100th anniversary of President Abraham Lincoln's birth. It became the first U.S. coin to feature a president, setting the standard for all modern coins. The penny was a huge success and has undergone several design changes over the decades. But one thing has remained consistent. It's a favorite of coin collectors around the world. The 1980D penny is part of the long-running series, but it's far from ordinary. In fact, the Denver-minted coins of this year have gained a legendary status, and here's why. The year 1980 marked a fascinating period for U.S. coinage. The U.S. mint was dealing with rising inflation, and the cost of producing copper coins was becoming a major issue. To combat this, the mint started experimenting with different alloys and techniques to reduce production costs while maintaining the quality of their coins. For pennies, the composition at the time was 95% copper and 5% zinc. But what makes the 1980D penny special is that only a few of them were struck with extraordinary precision and quality, making them stand out from the millions of pennies produced that year. AT the Denver Mint, known by its D mint mark, a very limited number of these pennies came out in pristine condition, and some of them had unique minting errors or characteristics that added to their rarity. Over time, these pennies became almost impossible to find in perfect condition driving their value through the roof. Now, let's get to the real question. Why is this 1980D penny worth $1.20 million? The answer lies in a combination of factors, rarity, condition, and historical significance. Even though millions of pennies were produced in 1980, only a handful of the 1980D pennies survived in mint-state condition. Over the years, most pennies have been circulated, meaning they've been used in everyday transactions, leading to scratches, dirt, and overall wear. Finding a 1980D penny in perfect, uncirculated condition today is like finding a needle in a haystack. When it comes to rare coins, condition is everything. The highest grade a coin can receive from professional grading services like PCGS or NGC is MS70, which stands for Mint State 70. This means the coin is in perfect condition, with no visible marks or imperfections. The 1980D penny we're talking about today was graded at the highest possible level making it one of the finest known examples of this coin in existence. It's practically flawless. Some of these pennies also have rare minting errors, such as off-center strikes or double dies. These errors make the coins even more valuable to collectors, who are always on the lookout for unique variations. A rare error on a 1980D penny could easily drive up its value by tens of thousands of dollars, if not more. There's always a high demand for rare, high-grade Lincoln pennies. Collectors love completing their collections, and the 1980D penny in MS70 condition is a must-have for anyone who wants to own a piece of U.S. minting history. With so few of these pennies in such impeccable condition, the competition to own one is fierce, and that drives prices sky-high.so. How can you tell if you're sitting on a million-dollar penny? Here are some key things to look out for. Look for the D mint mark on the front of the coin, just below the date. This indicates that it was minted in Denver. If your penny looks like it's been through decades of pocket change, it's unlikely to be worth much. But if it's shiny, uncirculated, and free of scratches or blemishes, you might be in luck. If you believe you have a rare 1980D penny, the best thing you can do is get it professionally graded. A top-tier grading service like PCGS or NGC can assess the condition of your coin and assign it a grade. A high grade will significantly increase its value. Check for any unusual features like a double image of Lincoln's face off-center strikes, or strange markings. These minting errors are rare and can add immense value to your penny. The story of the 1980D Lincoln penny is a perfect example of how even the most ordinary objects can become extraordinary pieces of history. This penny, originally worth just a cent, is now valued at an incredible $1.2 million, a testament to its rarity, condition, and the passion of collectors. Who knows? Maybe you have a valuable penny sitting in your pocket change or tucked away in a jar at home. The world of coin collecting is full of surprises, and with some luck, you could uncover a hidden treasure. Thanks for joining me on this journey into the fascinating world of the 1980D Lincoln Penny. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss another update on rare and valuable coins. Drop a comment below if you've ever found a rare penny or if you're a coin collector yourself. And as always, keep searching, because you never know when you'll strike gold or in this case, copper. Until next time, happy collecting. Hey, coin collectors and history buffs. Welcome back to the channel. 
where we dive deep into the fascinating world of rare and valuable coins. Today, we have an incredible story about a seemingly ordinary coin that has turned into one of the most valuable pieces in the world of numismatics. We're talking about the 1980 no mint Mark Abraham Lincoln one cent penny, a coin that's now worth a staggering $1.90 million. Yes, you've heard that right. $1.9 million for a penny that you might have once overlooked in your pocket change. In this video, we'll break down the history of this coin, how it became so valuable, and why collectors are willing to pay such an astronomical price for it today. So sit back, relax, and let's dive into the fascinating journey of the 1980 no mint Mark Lincoln penny. First, Let's talk about the background of this coin. The Lincoln cent, or penny, has been in circulation since 1909, commemorating the 100th anniversary of Abraham Lincoln's birth. It was the first time a U.S. president appeared on a circulating coin, and the design was created by Victor D. Brenner. Over the years, the design of the Lincoln penny has gone through several changes, but one thing has remained constant, the Lincoln portrait on the obverse, or front, of the coin. Now, let's fast forward to 1980. By this time, the Lincoln cent was firmly established in U.S. currency, but not all pennies were created equal. Most pennies minted in the U.S. during this period carried a small letter, or mint mark, which indicated where the coin was struck. For example, pennies minted in Denver have a D mint mark, and those from San Francisco have an S. However, the Philadelphia mint traditionally did not use a mint mark on Lincoln cents, making those without one standard for Philly produced coins. But what makes the 1980 no mint mark penny special? After all, no mint mark from Philadelphia was not uncommon. The answer lies in a combination of rarity, pristine condition, and the story behind the discovery of these rare examples. The rarity of high grade, uncirculated 1980 no mint mark pennies is what sets them apart from the millions of other pennies minted that year. While millions of pennies were struck in 1980, the one we're talking about today is a bit of an anomaly. Most pennies minted in 1980 were not made with the kind of meticulous care that collectors look for. Over time, these coins were exposed to wear and tear as they circulated. However, a few uncirculated specimens managed to avoid the rigors of circulation, retaining their pristine condition. These uncirculated examples, especially those that have been graded by top agencies like PCGS or NGCS MS68 or higher, are what make this coin a collector's dream. Finding a coin from 1980 in near-perfect condition is extremely rare. Most coins in circulation show signs of wear and degradation, but in the rarest of cases, some pennies from this year were discovered in flawless condition, free from scratches, discoloration, or any other blemishes. These high-grade coins are the ones that attract the big bucks at auction houses and in private sales. What makes this penny even more fascinating is the fact that it's so ordinary in appearance. From the outside, it looks just like any other penny you might have in your pocket. There's no silver, no gold, no unique metals, just copper and zinc, like any other penny. But the perfect condition and rarity are what elevate this coin to its multi-million dollar status. Let's talk about the value of this 1980 no mint Mark Lincoln penny. As of today, its value has skyrocketed to an astonishing $1.9 million. That's right, $1.9 million for a single penny. This remarkable price tag is due to a few key factors. First and foremost is its rarity. Coins of this grade, with such pristine condition, are incredibly hard to come by. Many pennies from 1980 were either damaged, worn down, or lost, so to find one in perfect condition makes it a highly sought-after collector's item. Another factor contributing to its value is its historical significance. The 1980 Lincoln cent represents a period of transition in U.S. coinage, with the switch from copper to a primarily zinc composition, making the few high-quality copper cents from this year even more desirable. Finally, market demand plays a significant role in the coin's value. As more collectors enter the market, competition for rare and high-grade coins increases, driving prices higher. The 1980 no mint mark penny has become a symbol of rarity, beauty, and the thrill of the hunt for collectors, further inflating its worth. You may be wondering, why is this coin worth so much today? Well, the coin market, like any other collectible market, is driven by supply and demand. In the case of the 1980 no mint mark penny, the supply of high-grade coins is incredibly limited. With fewer and fewer of these coins in perfect condition, their value has soared over the years. Collectors and investors alike are eager to add such a rare and valuable piece to their collections, driving up demand. Another reason for the coin's high value is its condition. Coins are graded on a scale from 1 to 70 with 70 being a perfect, mint-condition coin. 
The 1980 no mint mark penny that reached the $1.9 million valuation is graded MS68 or higher, meaning it's in nearly perfect condition. Coins of this grade are exceedingly rare, and when one is found, it can fetch astronomical prices at auction. There have been some record-breaking sales of this penny at auctions over the years. One of the most famous sales took place at a prestigious auction house, where a perfect MS68 specimen of the 1980 no mint mark penny sold for nearly $1.9 million, setting a new benchmark for Lincoln cents. This jaw-dropping sale sent shockwaves through the coin-collecting community and solidified the penny's status as one of the most valuable modern coins in existence. The story behind the discovery of some of these high-grade coins adds to their mystique. Many of them were found in mint sets or uncirculated rolls that had been tucked away for decades, forgotten until a savvy collector realized their potential worth. Once graded and authenticated, these coins became prized possessions for serious numismatists. Now, if you're sitting at home wondering if you might have one of these valuable pennies, there are a few things you can look for. First, check the date. 1980 is the key you were talking about. Next, inspect the coin's surface. If it's free from scratches, discoloration, and damage, you may be holding something valuable. Finally, consider getting it graded by a professional service like PCGS or NGC. Even a lower-grade example of the 1980 no mint mark penny could still be worth a pretty penny, though only the top-tier grades will reach the million-dollar mark. So there you have it. The fascinating story of the 1980 no mint mark Lincoln penny, a coin that has defied expectations to become one of the most valuable pennies in the world. From its humble beginnings as a one-cent coin to its current market value of $1.9 million, this coin's journey is a testament to the power of rarity, condition, and collector enthusiasm. If you enjoyed learning about this remarkable coin, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more deep dives into the world of rare and valuable coins. Who knows, you might just have a treasure hiding in your pocket change. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Don't forget to comment down below if you think you've come across a rare coin or if there's another coin you'd like us to cover. Until then, happy collecting! Welcome back to our channel, Coin Enthusiasts. Today, we have a fascinating topic that might just be hiding in your pocket right now. We're diving deep into the world of the 1984 D. Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny Coin, a coin that's worth a staggering $1 million today. So, make sure you stick around as we unravel its history, its journey through time and why it has become one of the most valuable pennies in the market. First, let's set the stage. The Lincoln penny, or one-cent piece, was first minted in 1909, and it has been a staple of American currency ever since. The 1984 D. Penny, produced at the Denver Mint, is part of a series that continued to honor the legacy of President Abraham Lincoln. However, it's not just any ordinary penny, it's one that collectors and investors are eager to find. Now, what makes the 1984 D. Penny so special? Let's break down some of its unique characteristics. Design asterisk asterisk. The obverse features the iconic portrait of Abraham Lincoln, designed by Victor David Brenner, while the reverse showcases the Lincoln Memorial. Mint mark asterisk asterisk. The D mint mark indicates it was struck in Denver. Many collectors pay close attention to mint marks as they often signify different production numbers and rarity. Composition asterisk asterisk. This penny is made of 97.5% zinc and 2.5% copper, which was standard for pennies produced from 1983 onward. Rarity asterisk asterisk. While millions were produced, the rare variants and specific errors make the 1984 D penny particularly sought after. Let's take a step back and explore the history of the 1984 D penny. In 1984, the U.S. was experiencing significant changes economically and culturally. The Mint produced over 7.5 billion pennies that year alone, with the Denver Mint contributing a significant portion to this number. However, what was happening behind the scenes was even more interesting. In 1984, there were reports of a production error that led to some coins being double struck or misaligned. These rare varieties can command a high price in the market. Collectors have been on the lookout for these unique specimens, which adds to the intrigue surrounding the 1984 D penny. Now, let's get to the exciting part the current market value of the 1984 D. Penny. As of today, the value has skyrocketed to $1 million for those rare specimens. But how did we get here? Market demand asterisk asterisk. The demand for rare coins has increased as more collectors enter the market. The rarity and unique characteristics of the 1984 D. Penny have made it a hot commodity. Auction sales asterisk asterisk. There have been documented sales of 1984 D pennies with errors fetching prices in the six-figure range, 
setting a precedent for the high valuation of well-preserved specimens. Grading asterisk asterisk. The condition of the coin plays a crucial role in its value. Coins that are graded MS-65 or higher by reputable grading services can command higher prices, especially among collectors looking for pristine examples. So, what should you do if you think you might have a valuable 1984 D penny? Here are some tips. Inspect your coins asterisk asterisk. Look for any signs of errors, double strikes, or unique features. The more unique your penny, the more valuable it could be. Get a professional grading asterisk asterisk. Consider having your coins graded by a professional service like the Numismatic Guarantee Corporation, NGC, or the Professional Coin Grading Service, PCGS. Join a community asterisk asterisk. Engage with other collectors and enthusiasts. Online forums and local coin clubs can provide valuable information and help you connect with potential buyers. To wrap things up, the 1984 D Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny is more than just a piece of currency. It's a piece of history with significant value. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting, keeping an eye out for this coin could lead to a fantastic find out if you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to stay updated on all things coins. And remember, you might just have a hidden treasure in your pocket. Hey there, coin enthusiasts. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we have an extraordinary topic to dive into, the 1989 No Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny. If you think pennies are just loose change, think again. This little piece of history could be worth a staggering $1.1 million. So, grab your magnifying glass and let's get into the fascinating world of this penny. The Lincoln Penny, introduced in 1909, was the first U.S. coin to feature a real person, President Abraham Lincoln. It has a rich history, commemorating Lincoln's legacy and his contributions to the nation. The design of the penny has changed over the years but it has remained a staple in American currency. The 1989 No Mint Mark Penny stands out for a few special reasons. Now, let's talk specifically about the 1989 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. While the Philadelphia Mint produced most of the Lincoln pennies that year, a few of them were released without a mint mark. This missing mint mark is what makes this particular penny so valuable. The rarity of the 1989 No Mint Mark Penny has skyrocketed its value. Initially, these pennies circulated like any other coin, but over the years, collectors began to recognize their significance. As of now, the current market value for a well-preserved 1989 No Mint Mark Penny is approximately $1.1 million. This incredible figure comes from its scarcity and demand among collectors and investors alike. But what factors contribute to such a high valuation? First and foremost, condition matters. Coins are graded on a scale from 1 to 70, with higher grades indicating better quality. A penny in mint condition, with no scratches or wear, will fetch a much higher price than one that shows signs of circulation. Secondly, demand plays a crucial role. As more collectors enter the hobby, the demand for rare coins like the 1989 No Mint Mark Penny increases, pushing prices even higher. Auctions and private sales have recently seen bidding wars for this penny, with collectors willing to pay top dollar to add it to their collection. Now, how can you identify if you have one of these valuable pennies? First, check for the absence of a mint mark. For pennies, mint marks are usually located just beneath the date. If you see no P, D, or S, then you have a no mint mark penny. Next, examine the condition. Use a magnifying glass to look for any signs of wear or damage. Once you've confirmed that you have a 1989 no mint mark penny, it's crucial to preserve it properly. Store it in a protective case to prevent scratches and environmental damage. Keep it away from moisture and extreme temperatures. Remember, the better the condition, the more it's worth. The world of coin collecting is vast and vibrant. Many collectors are passionate about finding rare pieces and sharing their discoveries. If you're interested in getting started or learning more, consider joining local or online coin clubs, attending coin shows, or following reputable numismatic resources. Engaging with the community can provide valuable insights and support. So there you have it. The incredible journey of the 1989 No Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny. From its humble beginnings to its current value of $1.1 million, this penny is a prime example of how small change can lead to big fortunes. If you found this video helpful or fascinating, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notification bell to stay updated on all things numismatic. Have you ever come across a rare penny? Let us know in the comments below. Until next time, Keep searching for those hidden treasures. Welcome back to our channel, 
where we dive deep into the fascinating world of rare coins. Today, we have an extraordinary topic that will leave you in awe, the 1991 no-mint Mark Lincoln one-cent penny coin. This seemingly ordinary penny has an incredible story and is valued at a staggering $2.1 million. So, if you think all pennies are just pocket change, you're in for a big surprise. Let's get started. First, let's take a moment to appreciate what makes the Lincoln penny so iconic. The Lincoln penny was first issued in 1909 to commemorate the 100th anniversary of Abraham Lincoln's birth. Designed by Victor David Brenner, it features Lincoln's profile on the obverse and the famous weed ears on the reverse, a design that remained until 1958. In 1959, the design was updated to feature the Lincoln Memorial, which is still used today. In 1991, the U.S. Mint produced a substantial number of one-cent coins, but what makes the 1991 no-mint mark Lincoln penny so special? The no-mint mark designation means that this coin was minted in Philadelphia, where coins are made without a mint mark. While the majority of pennies from this year are relatively common, a few rare specimens have emerged that hold extraordinary value. The rarity of the 1991 no-mint mark penny can be attributed to several factors, including a handful of errors during the minting process. In particular, certain coins exhibited unique features like doubling, which can drastically increase their value. Coins that are graded by professional services, such as the Professional Coin Grading Service, PCGS, or Numismatic Guarantee Corporation, NGC, can fetch unbelievable prices at auction. A pristine, uncirculated specimen of this penny has been known to reach prices as high as $2.1 million. So, how can you identify if you have one of these rare coins? Here are some tips. Check the date asterisk asterisk make sure it is indeed a 1991 no mint mark penny. Look for errors asterisk asterisk inspect for any doubling on the letters or features, particularly in the word liberty or Lincoln's beard. Examine the condition asterisk asterisk the value greatly increases with the condition of the coin. Look for coins that are uncirculated or in mint condition. If you believe you have one of these rare coins, consider getting it graded by a professional. The market for rare coins, particularly those with unique histories and characteristics, has been booming in recent years. Collectors and investors alike are searching for these hidden treasures. The sale of the 1991 no mint Mark Lincoln penny for $2.1 million is a testament to how rare coins can appreciate in value over time. Auctions often draw significant attention and the competition can drive prices to astonishing heights. As we wrap up, it's clear that the 1991 no-mint Mark Lincoln penny is more than just a coin. It's a piece of history with immense value. If you find a penny in your pocket, take a moment to check its details. Who knows? You might be sitting on a small fortune. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more exciting coin stories and tips. Share your thoughts in the comments below. Have you ever found a rare coin? Until next time, happy hunting. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more. Asterisk. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we have a very exciting topic for all you coin enthusiasts out there. We're diving deep into the world of rare coins, specifically the 1993 D Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny. Did you know that this little penny can be worth a whopping dollar 2.3 million? That's right. Let's explore its history what makes it so valuable, and how you can identify one in your collection. The Lincoln Penny was first introduced in 1909 to commemorate the 100th anniversary of Abraham Lincoln's birth. Designed by sculptor Victor David Brenner, the coin features a profile of Lincoln on the obverse and the iconic Lincoln Memorial on the reverse, which was introduced in 1959. Throughout the years, the Lincoln Penny has seen various changes, including the introduction of the Union Shield design in 2010. However, Today we're focusing on the 1993 D Mint Mark version, which was produced at the Denver Mint. The 1993 D Mint Mark Lincoln Penny is part of the Memorial Series, and it is a copper penny, made primarily of 95% copper and 5% zinc. The D stands for the Denver Mint, where this penny was struck. In 1993, the Denver Mint produced over 5 billion Lincoln pennies, but only a very small number of these coins exhibit a rare characteristic that makes them immensely valuable. So, what makes the 1993 D penny so special? It's all about the double die obverse error. This error occurs during the minting process, when the die strikes the coin twice, resulting in a noticeable doubling of the letters in the word liberty and the date. Finding a 1993 D penny with this error is extremely rare, and that's what drives its value up. 
While most 1993 D pennies are worth just one cent, those with the double die error have been auctioned for over $2 million in some cases, depending on their condition. Currently, the market value for a 1993 D mint Mark Lincoln penny with the double die error is estimated at around $2.3 million. This amount can fluctuate based on factors such as demand, the coin's condition, and whether it has been graded by a professional coin grading service. I in general, collectors are willing to pay top dollar for coins that are in excellent condition, so if you happen to find one of these pennies, make sure to keep it safe and consider getting it appraised. Now, let's talk about how you can identify whether your 1993D penny might be one of these rare gems. 1. Look for doubling asterisk. Use a magnifying glass or jeweler's loop to inspect the coin closely. The most noticeable feature of the double die error is the doubling in the word liberty and the date. Check the condition asterisk asterisk coins that are uncirculated or in mint condition are worth much more than those that show wear and tear. Get it graded asterisk asterisk if you believe you have a valuable coin. Consider sending it to a reputable grading service like PCGS or NGC for professional authentication and grading. In conclusion, the 1993 D Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny is not just a simple piece of currency. It's a piece of history that can be worth millions if you're lucky enough to find the right one. So, keep your eyes peeled while sorting through your change. You never know what treasures you might have in your collection. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more exciting content about valuable coins and their fascinating stories. Thanks for watching, and happy hunting! Hey everyone! Welcome back to the channel! Today, we're diving into an extraordinary piece of American numismatic history, the 1994 No Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny. You might not believe it, but this little coin is worth a whopping $1 million. Stick around as we explore its fascinating history, value, and why it's become such a sought-after collector's item. The Lincoln Penny was first introduced in 1909 to commemorate the 100th anniversary of Abraham Lincoln's birth. Designed by Victor David Brenner, it features the iconic image of Lincoln on the obverse and the Lincoln Memorial on the reverse, which was used from 1959 until 2008. The 1994 penny is particularly interesting because it carries the legacy of one of the most significant figures in American history. Now, let's talk about mint marks. Most coins produced by the U.S. Mint have a mint mark indicating where they were made, either Philadelphia, Denver, or San Francisco. In 1994, pennies were minted in Philadelphia and Denver. But here's the twist, some of the pennies minted in Philadelphia were produced without a mint mark. This is where our 1994 no mint mark Lincoln penny comes into play. The 1994 No Mint Mark Penny has garnered attention due to its rarity. While millions of Lincoln pennies are produced each year, the absence of a mint mark makes this specific coin unique. Collectors often seek out coins that have a low survival rate or production anomalies, and the 1994 No Mint Mark Penny fits that bill perfectly. Over the years, various examples of the 1994 No Mint Mark Penny have sold for impressive sums at auctions with the market price reaching a staggering $1 million for specimens in mint condition. The combination of rarity and demand has created a thriving market for this little coin. So, what factors contribute to the coin's high value? Let's break it down. 1. Condition. Coins are graded on a scale from 1 to 70. The higher the grade, the more valuable the coin. The best examples of the 1994 No Mint Mark Penny can reach grades of 65 or higher, significantly boosting their worth point too. Rarity. While many 1994 pennies were produced, the no mint mark variety is considerably rarer, making it highly desirable among collectors. Point 3. Historical significance. Lincoln is one of the most revered figures in American history, and anything connected to him, especially in coin form, attracts a lot of interest. Spotting a 1994 no mint mark penny is straightforward. Look at the reverse side of the coin. If there's no mint mark located just beneath the date, congratulations. You might have a valuable piece of history on your hands. Check the condition carefully. Look for wear, scratches, or discoloration. If you think you have one of these valuable coins, here are some tips on how to sell or appraise it. 1. Get it graded. Having your coin professionally graded by a reputable service can significantly increase its value. Point 2. Consult experts. Reach out to local coin dealers or attend coin shows to get appraisals from knowledgeable professionals. Point 3. Auction it. Consider selling your coin at a reputable auction house, where collectors are often willing to pay top dollar for rare pieces. To wrap it up, the 1994 No Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny is not just a common coin. It's a valuable treasure worth $1 million. Its rarity. 
historical significance, and a growing interest among collectors make it a must-have for any serious numismatist. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more fascinating stories from the world of coins. And if you have a 1994 Nomad Mark Penny, consider yourself lucky, you might just be sitting on a small fortune. Hey there, coin enthusiasts. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into a remarkable coin that's capturing the attention of collectors everywhere. The 2012 No Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny. This little coin may look unassuming, but its value and history are anything but ordinary. Stick around as we explore why this penny is worth a staggering $10,000. The 2012 Lincoln Penny is part of the ongoing series of one cent coins featuring the iconic image of Abraham Lincoln. The obverse, or front side, showcases a profile of Lincoln, designed by Victor David Brenner, which has been in circulation since 1909. The reverse of the coin features the familiar Union Shield design, introduced in 2010. But what sets the 2012 No Mint Mark Penny apart from its peers? It's the absence of a mint mark that makes it so special. Most pennies minted in 2012 carry a P or D mint mark, indicating they were struck in Philadelphia or Denver. However, the No Mint Mark version was also produced, leading to significant interest among collectors. Let's take a moment to delve into the history and minting process of this coin. In 2012, the United States Mint produced over 3 billion one-cent coins. While the exact mintage numbers for the no-mint mark version remain unclear, it is widely believed that far fewer of these coins were made compared to their PND counterparts. This scarcity has contributed to its high demand among collectors. So, why is the 2012 no-mint mark penny valued at $10,000? The primary reason is its rarity. As collectors search for unique pieces to complete their collections, this penny has become a sought-after item. The combination of a low mintage, unique features, and its iconic design has created a perfect storm for value appreciation. The rarity and high demand for the 2012 No Mint Mark Penny have pushed its market value significantly. Coins like this are not just currency. They are historical artifacts that tell a story. Identifying a genuine 2012 No Mint Mark Penny can be tricky, especially with counterfeits on the rise. Here are a few tips for collectors. 1. Look for the absence of a mint mark asterisk check the reverse side for the mint mark. If it's not there, you might have the coin you're looking for. Point 2. Examine the quality asterisk pay attention to the condition. Coins in uncirculated condition will be worth significantly more than those that show wear and tear. Point 3. Get it graded asterisk if you believe you have one of these valuable coins. Consider having it graded by a professional service. A higher grade can greatly increase its value. Now, let's talk about the current market trends for the 2012 No Mint Mark Penny. As of now, collectors are actively trading these coins, and prices can fluctuate based on demand. You might find listings ranging from a few hundred dollars for lower quality examples to the impressive $10,000 for those in pristine condition. If you're looking to add a 2012 No Mint Mark Penny to your collection, where should you start? Here are some great places to look. Coin shops asterisk asterisk local coin shops often have knowledgeable staff who can help you find rare coins. Online auctions asterisk asterisk websites like eBay and Heritage Auctions frequently feature high-value coins. Coin shows asterisk asterisk attending coin shows can provide opportunities to network with other collectors and potentially score a rare find. In summary, the 2012 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny is a fascinating piece of numismatic history and its current market value of $10,000 makes it an exciting target for collectors. If you have one of these coins, you might just have a small fortune in your pocket. Thanks for joining me today. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more content like this, and let me know in the comments if you've ever come across this rare penny. Until next time, happy collecting! Welcome back to our channel. Today, we have an exciting episode for all you coin enthusiasts out there. We're diving into the fascinating world of the 2020 No Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny. This little piece of history isn't just a common penny, it's worth a staggering $14,000, so stick around as we explore its history, value, and why it has collectors buzzing. Let's start with a brief overview. The 2020 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny was produced in Philadelphia, as evidenced by the absence of a mint mark. The design of the penny is based on the iconic Abraham Lincoln portrait on the obverse, which has been in use since 1909. The reverse features the classic Union Shield design introduced in 2010, symbolizing the unity of the states. In 2020, the U.S. Mint produced billions of pennies,
but this particular penny stands out due to its rarity and demand. While millions of Lincoln pennies are produced each year, specific years and minting errors can make certain coins significantly more valuable. In this case, the 2020 no mint mark penny became a collector's item for several reasons that we'll explore shortly. To understand the value of the 2020 penny, we need to take a step back into history. Abraham Lincoln has been a prominent figure in American history, and his image on the penny serves as a reminder of his legacy. The Lincoln penny was first introduced in 1909 to commemorate the 100th anniversary of Lincoln's birth. Over the years, it has undergone several design changes, but its significance has remained unchanged. The 2020 penny continues this legacy and has become a symbol of not just Lincoln's life, but also the evolution of American currency. Now, let's talk about rarity and collector demand. The 2020 no mint mark penny is considered rare because many collectors began to notice that fewer of these coins were in circulation compared to other years. As coin collectors know, rarity drives value. The combination of a limited supply and a growing interest in coin collecting, especially during the pandemic, has led to a significant spike in the value of this penny. So, what's the current market value? Right now, the 2020 no mint mark Lincoln penny can fetch prices upwards of $14,000 at auction. This value can vary based on factors like condition, grading, and the presence of any minting errors. Coins in mint condition, graded MS65 or higher, are particularly sought after, leading to higher selling prices. Now that you know its worth, how do you identify a 2020 no mint mark Lincoln penny? First, check for the date. It should clearly read 2020 on the obverse side. Next, look for the absence of a mint mark, which is typically found on the obverse below the date. Finally, inspect the coin for any notable errors or anomalies that could enhance its value even further. If you happen to find a 2020 no mint mark penny, it's essential to take care of it properly. Store it in a protective coin holder, and keep it in a cool, dry place away from sunlight to prevent tarnishing. Avoid cleaning it with harsh chemicals, as this can significantly reduce its value. Thinking of buying or selling? There are numerous avenues to consider. You can find these coins on platforms like eBay, Heritage Auctions, or at local coin shops. Be sure to do your research and possibly get an appraisal to ensure you're getting a fair price. In conclusion, the 2020 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny is not just another coin. It's a valuable piece of history that has captured the attention of collectors worldwide. Its current market value of $14,000 makes it a hot item for anyone interested in numismatics. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel for more coin-related content, and let us know in the comments if you've ever come across a valuable penny. Thanks for watching, and happy collecting! Hey everyone! Welcome back to our channel! Today, we're diving into a fascinating topic for all you coin collectors and history buffs out there, the 2021 No Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny Coin. You might not think much of a penny, but stick around because this little coin has a lot of history and is worth a whopping $8,000. Let's get started. The Lincoln penny has been a staple of American currency since its introduction in 1909, celebrating the 100th anniversary of Abraham Lincoln's birth. Fast forward to 2021, and we find a coin that has captured the interest of collectors due to its unique features and rarity. First, let's talk a bit about the history of the Lincoln penny. The coin was designed by Victor David Brenner and features President Abraham Lincoln on the obverse side and a depiction of the Lincoln Memorial on the reverse. In 2010, the U.S. Mint also introduced new reverse designs to celebrate the 200th anniversary of Lincoln's birth, which continued through to 2021 with new and interesting themes. The 2021 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny was produced at the Philadelphia Mint. Unlike its counterparts, which may have mint marks indicating where they were produced, the 2021 penny was struck without any mint mark. This aspect, along with a limited production run, contributes to its current high market value. Asterisk. Now let's discuss the value of the 2021 no mint mark Lincoln penny. As of now, this coin is valued at around $8,000. But how did it reach this astonishing price? The rarity of the coin plays a significant role. Since its release, the 2021 no mint mark penny has become sought after by collectors, primarily due to its low mintage compared to earlier years. Collectors are always on the lookout for coins that are less commonly found, and this penny fits the bill perfectly. Now, if you're wondering how to identify this particular penny, here are a few tips. 1. Obverse side asterisk. Look for the familiar image of Abraham Lincoln. 
The absence of a mint mark indicates it was produced in Philadelphia. 2. Reverse side asterisk. Check for the unique design, which continues the tradition of featuring Lincoln's legacy. 3. Condition matters asterisk. The condition of the coin plays a vital role in its value. Higher grade coins, especially those graded by professional services, can command even higher prices. The demand for rare and unique coins has only increased over the years. Collectors are willing to pay premium prices for coins like the 2021 No Mint Mark Penny because they represent more than just currency. They embody a piece of history. I reached out to some collectors and experts to get their take on this penny. Let's hear what they have to say. The 2021 No Mint Mark Penny is a great example of how modern coins can become valuable. Collectors are looking for something different, and this penny definitely fits that description. Rarity and demand drive the market. The fact that it was produced without a mint mark makes it even more intriguing. So, what does the future hold for the 2021 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny? As more collectors learn about its rarity, the value may continue to climb. It's always exciting to see how the market responds to different coins. Before we wrap up, here's a tip for you. Always check your change. You never know when you might stumble upon a hidden gem like the 2021 No Mint Mark Penny. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more coin-related content, and share your thoughts in the comments below. Have you come across any valuable coins recently? Let us know! Thanks for watching, and happy collecting! That wraps up our journey through the top 150 most valuable ultra-rare Lincoln one-cent pennies. We hope you enjoyed learning about these fascinating coins and maybe even found some inspiration for your collection. If you have any questions or comments, drop them below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more exciting content from our channel. Happy collecting!